do that. I know a lot of people are on, what's this online thing you call, Zoom? Yeah, very good, very good. Don't miss the point. Please, I always like to repeat, don't miss the point. A lot of people are online on Zoom. But then a lot of times you're off track in Ramadan. What do I mean by that? This is the month for you to be reading Quran. This is the month for you to be praying Nafil Salah. This is the month for you to be doing giving charity. Now you're on Zoom in only listening to talk. Now it's action. Ramadan is about action. Throughout the year. Throughout the year we should be listening on Zoom in. Learning, listening. That when Ramadan comes, you can put what you learned throughout the year in action. Now you should be looking for poor people to give charity. Now, people, now we should be spending extra time. Yeah. Read an extra nafil salah. The Prophet, peace be upon him, says what? Qiyamul Layl in the nights of Ramadan, stand in prayer. A lot of masajids are closed. You don't get tarawih. Alhamdulillah, we are open. Mashallah, six feet. Self-distance. We are practicing the law, bi'idhnillah. But what about the people who are closed? Muslims can't go to the masjid for tarawih. But you're online. You should be doing nafil prayer. The Prophet, peace be upon him, says, pray extra nafil in the nights of Ramadan. Read extra Quran. I'm not saying don't go online and don't learn and don't listen. But by the time Ramadan is done, you are like, I didn't spend much time reading Nafil prayer. I didn't complete my Quran. I didn't look for poor people to give charity. I didn't do much kindness and much amal in this month of Ramadan. I was just zooming in online and I ended up being off track in Ramadan. Ramadan is a month of amal. I'm not saying don't go online. Eh? We do a lot of services online. But you got to know your priority. When it's time for talk and when it's time for action. Ramadan is a month of amal. 